guys, One Piece Nation here today with a One Piece video. Now, while I had not been enjoying my whole King Island arc, as I said in my video talking about why I had not been reviewing it, I do still love this theory. And even though we're very far from it, I got thinking a little bit a couple of minutes ago, how do I want this theory to end? So I sat down, I thought about it, and today I'm going to tell you how I want One Piece to end. Me, on a personal level, how I want this all to wrap up. Now, mind you, I am not talking about what I want the One Piece to be, what, how I want, what I want the final battles to be. No, I'm talking about how I want, what, what I want no, One Piece's Naruto 700 to be. Alright, what, that ending, like, the literal ending. Alright, where you find out where everybody ends up, where we find out what happens to everybody. The chapter that comes after all the fighting. Okay, so first of all, I want all the Straw Hats to live. Okay, okay, so for me to, for me to be satisfied with this ending, the Straw Hats all need to survive. I'm sorry, for me to be truly satisfied with it, if the Straw Hats die, I'm going to be pissed off. Like, I'll accept it, I'll, it will probably be an amazing death scene, I don't give a crap if the Straw Hats die. If a straw hat dies, I will be pissed. Alright, next. Now, I feel, personally, the world government should be brought down. Now, I know I think I'm going to, get, going to get into battle, but this is part of the ending. When the world government gets brought down and destroyed, that will happen, and a new government will arise. But, in the process of destroying the government, I want the straw hat. To, a, to become enemy to the Revolutionary Army. Now allow me to explain. Alright, think about it. If the Straw Hat and the Revolutionary Army are allies, and the Revolutionary Army takes down the world government, all of the Straw Hat's help, doesn't that technically make the Straw Hat heroes and good guys? And wouldn't the Revolutionary Army then be able to take away their status as pirates? So I think it would be really good if an ironic twist that they, the Straw Hats, do help, but they also, like, kill, like, really cause damage to the Revolutionary Army and make and become enemy with them. Not saying Luffy and Sabo would fight. I feel like Sabo would, Sabo would kind of be like, Sabo would be like, Luffy, I've got your back. And Sabo would back up Luffy and be like, and Dragon and Luffy would probably, and maybe Dragon and Luffy could have, like, a little scuffle. Because Luffy honestly doesn't give a shit about Dragon, honestly, if we're being honest here. <laughs> and that's that really cool, Dragon versus Luffy. No, but uh, Luffy and Sabo could like team up against that kind of or something. But the point is, is that the world government, that, so when the Revolutionary Army forms a new government, after the world government is brought down, this is what would happen. The Straw Hat Pirates would become enemies of the new government. They'd be enemies of the new government, and they would and we'd get like a time skip. We like a time, you look like time skip montages, we get one of those. And we're still with Straw Hat being pirates for a couple more years. And in a couple more years, uh, Luffy's overuse of uh, a new, Luffy will have gotten a new gear. And his, or a new ability, and it's overuse of maybe his awakening, his new gear. Or maybe we'll just skip ahead to when all the time he lost in Impel Down. Like, all the, we'll skip to when all that starts to affect him. And it'll start growing weaker, very similarly to very similarly to Roger. He'll grow weaker, and he'll, he'll, and we'll see them having a battle with the marine with the new marine, probably led by Kobe. That like smokers like an like, or maybe smokers like the fleet admiral and Kobe's like for the one fighting Luffy. That'd be pretty cool. But you can squish those out with, with the either ones, with new ones, either one would do. Kobe Fleet Admiral, Smoker Admiral, Smoker Fleet Admiral, Kobe Admiral, who cares? The point is, is that Luffy would be fighting and he would, and he would get beat up. Like, he'd be, Zoro would need to come in and save him. And maybe like Nami, Usopp, or Chopper would get hurt because he couldn't protect them. Because his body was weakened. So, after that, we would... Luffy would disband the Straw Hat Pirates, they would disband, and Luffy would uh, go to Fushu Village, and would go and turn himself in, like Roger did. He would turn himself in in Fushu Village, 
And this is it. And he would be executed in either Fuchsia Village or Logtown. I can't decide. But the point is that he'll be about to be executed when he's go when he's up on the thing. On the plot, when he's up on the uh, stage about to be executed. Um, we'll see. We'll Oda will have like panels of these mysterious and figure, the silhouette of the character entering the area and climbing up like to the top of a building. Over that is like across from the execution platform, and what will happen is, is that uh, the Marine will of course walk Luffy out, and Luffy will be in cell. Like Luffy will like Luffy will probably ask a stupid question like, "Can I have some meat?" Like he's about to die, and he's like, "Hell, I'm about to die, but can I have some meat first? I wanna, I wanna, I wanna have meat before I die." And the guard will be like, "Screw you, no! Like don't kill us, please." And uh, the guard will be all terrified of the pirate, Luffy, the pirate king. And Luffy will sit down, and right before they execute him, a voice will yell, wait. And of course, uh, Luffy will he'll look up, and he'll see, uh, all the straw hats standing there with their arms up, like, but, you know, it'll be a throwback to Alabasta, where they all have their arms up, and they have the, and, but in, where they all are looking at Luffy. But instead, um, it, but instead of having an X on their arm, they turn around and they all engraved an X. An X. An X mark. I can't say it. X. X. They all engraved an X into their chest. Like, from here to here. Like, all of them. Even, even Nami and Robin. Like, here to here. They engraved them across their chest. And you can just... And, and the, and they all give like a speech to Luffy about how, about, about like how much of an honor it was to follow him. And with that, after they do that, some random guy would yell out, "What? What did you do with it? What did you do with Roger's treasure?" And he said, and, and Luffy would be like, "I I didn't even I never moved it. It still remains." Keep searching. And he, you know, continued the pirate aid. And he inspired millions of people to continue with their dreams. And he executed and died with a smile on his face. And then we would cut to a... We would cut to a... Now this is good enough. This is the part where we get a little controversial. This is how I would like it. Now, first of all, let's go back to my opinion on a Luffy relationship with Nami. And no, this is nothing romantic. This is no pairing bullshit. But Luffy has always trusted Nami with his hat. So I think before he leaves to be executed, he would leave the hat with her. And I think we would cut, like, you know, maybe 30 years, 20, 30 years later to Nami just hanging out with a sitting in a bar on some random island with this kid. No, nah, you know, Nani's like walking down the street. And she sees this kid standing in front of this other kid. This boy standing in front of this little, this, this uh, little girl. And he's like, leave my friends alone. And she starts observing him. And she starts reminding her of Luffy. So she goes over and she stays his ass, easily, obviously. And they start talking. And she starts, and she mentions he was a pirate and the kid's face lights up. And he asked a ton of questions, and he started telling stories about how she was a pirate. The kid asked her to take, to if he can go on an adventure with her, and she said, no, I'm not a pirate anymore. Like, you know, you know, obviously, unlike Shanks, Nami retired. She gave up that life when Luffy died. So she's kind of like a uh, criminal hobo. She's a criminal hobo. She's a criminal hobo with lots of money. That's what Nami would be. She just kind of looked good. Roaming the world, doing whatever the hell she wants, like you know, conning people, stealing money, whatever. But the kid gets angry and starts screaming at her, and she and and, and then he and and the whole time Nami wearing the straw hat. He takes the straw hat off and she puts it, and then, and then the kid is like, "You won't take me with you, fine. Then I'm gonna gather my own crew and find the one piece." And then, and then Nami takes the hat off. And places it on that kid's head, and, and put and tells it and tells and she tells him, "I am going to go somewhere. I am going to go to to the deep to the most dangerous thing in the world. 
Once you are a great pirate, sneak me out and return this to me. So then Nami would travel all the way to the new world. And just wait. And then, and, and just wait. And then the, the kid would put his hands up and be like, I'm going to be king of the pirates. Like, this is the kid that inherited Luffy will. And of course, the promise is very different. And that would be the difference. Nami's not, not like a Yoko or a legendary pirate, but she's pretty much like all the good of a new world and all this chill on some random island. And you can come by, and if you can, like, deep. I, I, I would assume Nami would probably, like, wait on, like, one of the road Ponoglyph Island. Like, the very end of a new world, so he can only meet her again if he becomes a great pirate. And, and, and then we, and then we just hear laughter. And then, and then we, Nami leaves the town, and we cut to the kid, like, years later, getting in, getting on, like, a, getting onto a boat. And he shouts, I'm gonna be king of the pirates again. But this time, we just hear, we just hear Luffy laughing. And, and, and that's how the theory would end. With this new kid, set out by a member, in, that's in dreams, were inspired by a member of Luffy's crew, that were given the hat by Nami. And this new kid that's now the state of the King of the Pirates, and the last scene is Luffy. It's just, we don't see him as a person, we just hear it. Like, she, 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 she. He's just laughing, we hear that, and then it cuts to black, and the story ends. We're not wondering whether or not, we're not knowing that this, that this kid has inherited Luffy's will. That is my, that is how I would end One Piece. That's how I would like One Piece to end. That is how I would end it. Tell me how you would end One Piece or how you want it to end in the comment section down below. Now, I'm going to be doing more videos like this, more general One Piece videos, as I'm not enjoying my whole King Island arc. I'm going to try to get back onto it with the reviews, but I'm just not motivated to do whole King Island videos. So, leave topic suggestions in the comments down below. Another thing you want me to cover, they don't necessarily need to be One Piece related. I would prefer if they were, but I also would like to do some Boruto stuff. So yeah, speaking of Boruto actually, I'm going to be doing a, a Boruto video about uh, Boruto, about the stuff going on in the Boruto anime later this week. And I'll probably do a Boruto chapter review of both. The newest chapter and the above the both of the newest chapter when the next chapter comes out. And yeah, I'll throw a bet to my review of the One Piece chapter out I would say probably next Thursday. I realize that there really isn't any point in putting it out to uh on Thursday if there's no chapter. What I'll probably do is I'll record a live reaction and a review and I'll just save them on my computer and then I'll you know, add them on to my live reaction and review next week. And yeah, and then I'll do like double reviews. Or I'll do something like that, I don't know. But it's best the double one pink review next week. And yeah, also go check out my Boruto review from yesterday. Um, yeah, go check that out on the channel if you watch Boruto. Hope you guys enjoyed. Like the video if you did. Subscribe for more videos. Tell me how you would add One Piece in the comments. And blah 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 guys, have a great day. Big One Piece Nation, signing out.